Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet and today we have the Four Roses small batch on the cask and yeah I do love Four Roses it has just a nice label and if you ever happen to go to Kentucky and it, I think it's the north eastern side of Kentucky and if you ever happen to go there then you have to visit the, the distillery it's a beautiful distillery they have nice tasting rooms the tour is also really great and uh, they do have roses there it's a it it looks like a, a really a nice old southern building yeah so really go to the distillery it's it's a beautiful place there 45 percent abv so a bit more than the usual and has a bit of kick to it. Four Roses has a bit of a specialty. Other distilleries are known in America. They're always the yeast, very important. We have the old jerk from, I don't know, old, old, old master distiller. And they do not have uh, like an old yeast strain, but probably also old yeast strain, but they have like, um, I think two different mash bills and five yeast strains. And this is really, really, really exceptional. So they have like 10 recipes to produce because you can take the mash bills and then mix it with the yeast strains. And that is really, 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 uh, yeah, makes it really different. Yeast is a, a, a great product that is always underestimated in a whiskey. Yeah, so um, we have the normal Four Roses, which is a combination of all 10 recipes. Then we have the single barrel, which is what just one recipe, one barrel, one recipe. And then now we have here the small batch, which is yeah, small batches of barrels together. I don't know how much they call a small batch, but they say they have four recipes that go into the small batch. They do even number them, two, three, seven, and eight. <laughs> now that we know it, we're not any more intelligent than before because we don't know what kind of recipe is um, having what kind of effect on the whiskey. And yeah, the small batch is maturing for four, uh, six to seven years, so quite a number of years. Hmm, my question is, why don't they write it on the bottle then? Or do they? No. Uh, four select crafted from four select bourbons, handcrafted. Yeah, and it's. Lawrenceburg. Hopefully that is north, northeastern uh, Kentucky. Otherwise, the people from Lawrenceburg will write me in the comments and say we are not there. But I think I, I think I remember that they are. Uh, they are not one of these very southern distilleries, but they are inside Kentucky. They are a bit more northern than than usually. Uh, yeah, let's have a look. Mm. Oh. it's honey it's definitely a bourbon you definitely with vanilla honey but also a little bit spiciness going on in the glass a little bit of a yeah nutmeg feeling in there going on a little bit of a yeah baking sensation going on mm. A little bit of a strange oaky, not oaky, but, but woody touch to it. Oaky, oaky comes through with the vanilla and caramel definitely a lot, but with a little bit of a oak, a little bit of a, hmm, strange, hmm, strange note in there. Like, like I have a little bit of a, a little bit of a lightly rye note in there as well. Hmm. Hmm. Mmm. Oh, this is a strong and intense bourbon. Mm -hmm. mm. This has a lot more kick to it than you usually have from a, a, a bourbon. Bourbon is light and uh, vanilla character. It does have that in there, but this one is much spicier, intense oh characters in there a bit of a honey touch bit of a little touch to it it can't ha hide that it's a bourbon definitely but it has a, a strength to it and yeah it definitely feels like an older bourbon as well it, it's not over matured as in 12 years and above with in fresh casts and in, in kentucky 12 years are just a 
a bunch in there but it's uh it has a good amount of oak in it mm. 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 so yeah if you're a bit disappointed with the um, yeah mild mellow and mm, then might as well go for the full, full roast small batch because it has that that little bit of a spiciness going on that, that just gives it more volume in that glass 45 percent abv just helps it to transport that volume definitely mm, i do like it mm. the small batch is uh is good but mm, um yeah it comes with a a, a really really not extremely cheap price but uh the price for that i would have expected like 40 bucks or something like that but uh it costs 30 30 euros here in in europe not quite sure how much it costs in the netherlands but around that price as well and if you happen to like that um please feel free to go to whiskey.com and find that four roses and we ship to the netherlands now hmm. but yes spicy bourbon six to seven years for 30 bucks that is quite a good price hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Oh, good amount of kick to it mm, i like it yeah so that was my review of the four roses small batch thank you very much for watching and see you next time